Congratulations, Emma. You just won the first clay court match on the WTA tour. Uh, 6162, um, was it as easy as the score line suggests? Definitely not. I feel like there were many long, long juice games, and um, so I'm very happy to have battled through against Storm. You know, she's played two matches in qualifying, and uh, but she's a great opponent we played last year and is extremely tricky so I'm, I'm just really happy to have somehow found a way to come through those long games and uh, put on a good performance. You said you had not played very much as a junior on this surface. What is the special challenge on this surface for you? I think it's definitely the duration of the points. Um, that's something that I need to just work on as I spend more time on clay and it will improve my craftiness and uh, variety as well of shots. So um, I'm, I'm just looking forward to spending more time on this surface going forward. Well, uh, looking back a few months at the US Open, you were certainly very crafty. What worked particularly well at the US Open that you're hoping to replicate looking forward to the French? Yeah, I mean, at the US Open, I think the biggest thing was just having zero expectations and just going out there and having fun every single match and having a swing. And I think that's something that over time I've definitely developed and, and starting to do more and more. So um, yeah, I'm just really enjoying my tennis at the moment. Looking forward, you're gonna play against the German, Tamara Korpac. She came through as a lucky loser. How much do you know about her? Um, no, I don't know anything about her right now, but um, yeah, it must be a great opponent. Uh, come through a tough first round, so looking forward to, to playing a German on home turf. Yeah, I'm yeah. looking forward to that match. Seeing you again on Santa Court. Meine Damen und Herren, Emma Raducano. Thanks, he was open to see